Fury. That's a fun new sponsor. Back. Well, you know, we here at Almost Live know that etiquette is very important. We know that our audience is always thirsting for etiquette. What's the proper thing to do in the proper situation? And that's why we're going to present tonight our own Mr. and Mrs. Manners. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Manners show. I'm Mr. Manners. And I'm Mrs. Manners. Now, our first letter is from Elsie of Packwood, Washington. Elsie writes, Dear Mr. and Mrs. Manners, when is it appropriate to seek marital counseling? Mm. Good question. Mm. Mr. Manners, go ahead. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Uh -huh. uh, well, Elsie, you know, even the most wonderful of mm. marriages can run into to trouble once in a while. I think it was about two years ago when we had a real communication breakdown. We did, and that is the time to seek marital mm -hmm. counseling. We learned a whole new way of communicating. Right, a, a new language, if, if you will. Right, and the most important thing we learned was I mm. statements, learning to take responsibility for ourselves. Right, L like most couples, we used to accuse each other, you know, point mm. the finger with you statements. Mm -hmm. For example, I might turn to Mrs. Manners and say, you drive me crazy with your nagging and your whining. Right, right. Or, or perhaps I would say, Mr. Manners, you eat like a big, huge pig. But with I statements, I say, I am uncomfortable with the way you eat. Right, see, a non-threatening statement. Uh -huh. And I might, might reply, well, I feel angry when I think you're trying to control my behavior. Oh, and I might say, I don't think your anger is justified when uh, you're looking so idiotic. <laughs> Oh, I see. With, yeah, and, and, and I might say something like, well, I don't think I, I really look idiotic. I, I, I think I've been feeding myself successfully now for 30 years. Oh, well, oh, I see. And I might say, I don't consider it successful when there's rotting food all over the kitchen uh -huh. floor. And I say, I'm an adult now. I don't need another mother. And I don't see you as an adult when I see you spinning up like a little baby. Uh, I think you're the baby. I think you're... I think that... You, I, I re Sorry, I didn't hear what you said, Mr. Manners. I see. So you'd like to hear what I have to say? I mm -hmm. would. Because like I, I have some I statements I I'd like to share. I'd like to hear All the right, I statements. Fine. Go ahead. I hate you. I, I wish I never made you. I can't believe I said I do. I, I, I can't stand it anymore. I, I, Well, I think we have time for one more letter. Oh, Mrs. good. Uh, let's see. Uh, this is from Kirk of Tuckwilla. He says, Dear Mr. and Mrs. Manners, why is it impolite to point? Mm -hmm. Well, look at it this way, Kirk. When I point one finger at you, mm -hmm. there are three fingers pointing back at me. Right. <laughs> right, Mrs. Manners? Right, Mr. Manners. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Bye-bye. <laughs>